just says, oh, 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 oh. Do you see me now? Do you see anything now? Refreshing. No. Oh, yeah, it's live. You don't see anything? I do not. Maybe there's a delay. It says live for 17 seconds with zero viewers. So that's perfect. It's exactly the right number. <laughs> hmm. yeah, so I was hoping that subscribing would notify me that you had gone live, which I have seen before. Oh. Wait, no. I see. Ah, oh, here we go. Am I live? Oh, man. The voice is amazing. Oh, you hear yourself? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> nice. Oh, okay. <laughs> Oh, no, I hear you from 20 seconds ago. This is perfect. Okay, well, all right, let's see if this works. You sound like you're in a cave. This is awesome. Is it a bad a bad cave of sorts? All right, so I don't know what's happening with that, but look, there's me. There's not me. Oh, you'll see that in 20 seconds. Yeah. Okay, so... We're down to about 10, maybe. Oh, yeah, we're down to like five. Oh. So close to real time. Game plus me. I don't want that. I just want... What? No, not me. <laughs> Hold on. Off camera. Okay. All right, let's see if this... Let's see if I can actually start it. Why is it still showing me? I guess that's what it was. You know how desperately I want to stream me streaming you right now? <laughs> so that you can watch you through me. All right, what do you see? Blackness. Okay, let me... Game. Why is this? I don't want a camera for this. Okay, hold on. Remove. Yes. Okay. In capture. Oh, oh, hold on, hold on. So loud. Nothing? Nope. Let me know if that shows up. Darkness. Hello, dark. Alright, let me try to do a specific window. Empyrean, okay. Oop. Ah! Nice. A few seconds later, maybe it'll show up. Oh, I see a menu. Oh, we did it. All right, so there's a couple, I was just messing around, um, and I will start you. All right, so I have a creative one, and I was just going through a bunch of um, ships on the Steam Workshop, and just seeing what they look like. God, this is so loud, hold on. Cannot hear anything. Oh my God, stop. Crash. I crashed. I think I crashed it by doing that. I should have done that. Let me do that again. This time. Let me know when you see the menu again. I don't know if it automatically does this or not. So it's cutting off the right side of the screen. Just That's like, fine. That's the worst part. That's the low rent district. <laughs> I set this OBS thing up for um, our game nights. For like Jackbox and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I've, I've had a lot of success with streaming via Discord. Nice. All right. Let me know when you can see this. I can see this. Okay. 
so what well, I was just messing around with some chips, but what I was going to show you, this is this is a pretty good one here. But it's uh, it's a lot. You could build a lot more um, capable ships in smaller areas than in space engineers. So like, um, this is all vanilla right now. But anyway, oh, not this one. This is the one I was going to show you. What would be a good one? All these steam ships I got. Oh, I like this one. This one's pretty cool. This is almost exactly what I built in Space Engineers. Oh, yeah, actually, I'll show you this one. That one down there is basically what I built. But um, So in this ship, this is what I was going to show you that I messed around with. Is it off? I might turn the ship off. Oh, no. Okay, so in the ship, one, I have to figure out the controls because they're pretty bad, but um, you can hook up signal lines and all these. Uh, so then you can hook up, um, let's see if I can... You can hook up like all kinds of circuitry. Okay. Anyway, so you can you can make it do a bunch of crazy stuff like that. So once you like, so is stepping back a bit. Is the game a build chip by blocks game? Like... Yes, a voxel game. Yep, the same as Seven Days and because I looked up like best voxel games or whatever, and it was like Seven Days and this and Space Engineers and some other ones. Um, gotcha. Okay, so you can do, I haven't messed with any of this stuff in here, but you can like, uh, whatever that was, set up some sort of like signaling stuff and like, uh, so I have, um, turn off all lights. So somehow there's like sub circuits here. I can turn off my red, green ones. You can kind of see that too. Anyway, so there's stuff here to play with, um, a bunch of signal logic there. So this is what I was going to show you real quick, and then I'll show you the creative, which is all the crafting and oh, this this is the other thing. This is the uh, a detailed view of like your your thrust profile. Um, whenever you see this, yeah. like it's pretty deep. Um, but I haven't I haven't gotten much into this yet. But you can like look at what the what torque looks like, like how you're going to be able to torque based on your RCS setup. Uh, versus center of mass and all that. So, um, yeah. So that's pretty cool. Uh, this one also has a bunch of um, f food and oxygen requirements, more strict than space engineers. Like, because space engineers doesn't have anything but food unless you. Um, uh, stop. How do I exit? I can't do this from. Oh, there it is. Yeah, so then I'll show you what I was just starting the tutorial. And anyway, it looks like a like a lot of fun when you start looking at like all the food management because like on a lot of the um, capital ships you have to like plan for food and do other kind of things, but it's still not um, okay. So I landed on this planet in this crashed. I crashed on this thing. And inside there's a bunch of like pieces, food. I, I killed an animal. So like I was harvesting this thing. Let's see if I can find another one. I don't know what all these things do. This is some sort of detector. Oh, nice. So a resource detector. I don't know what this thing is. How do I choose tab? Oh yeah. So I have um, anyway, so there's a bunch of animals and critters. What is this? Detector, or scanner. Okay, so the survival tool is what I was using before. I'm gonna try to find an animal. But it's like a big beastie thing. Okay, so I think I can go here and see how many resource drill. So I'm getting some sort of rock, I guess. I don't know what you do with rock. Yeah, a lot of lazing of things. There's this big dinosaur-looking thing that I fought, like, r I guess right next to where I crashed. Oh, that's not. Yeah, and this is the salvage tool, so same thing. So getting something from this. Um. Yeah. Anyway, this is the basic game, but like the, it's apparently more like um, No Man's Sky, but there's a bunch of different biomes. I'm in a temperate one, so apparently the weather changes a lot here. 
But anyway, yeah. So that's what the game looks like so far. So is there uh, like a skill tree type of leveling system? Um. Let's see here. What did I see for, about that? I saw tech trees. I saw this. So I think, I don't think it's you having skills. I think it's you teching up different kinds. Unlocking of... new technologies. Yes. Oh, wow. Yeah, there are lots of levels. Yep. Um, but I don't know what else there is there. I, this is, you've seen as much as I've seen now. <laughs> oh, there's one. My reputation is unfriendly. Nailed it. Yeah, so like the AI is already better than space engineers for these NPCs. And there's better weaponry. It's not just rockets and... Not just rockets and uh, Gatling guns. There's a bunch of like... This is the game for 12 bucks or something. Yeah. Interesting. So if you want it, I can repay in kind and buy the game. If you do not. I mean, I'm not opposed. Yeah, I don't, it's not, but if space games aren't your thing, like I'm not gonna force the issue, I can just play. No, I, I like space games a lot, actually. Yeah, so, like, okay. I, Liam and his friends have been playing No Man's Sky, which is kind of game So I think this is supposed to be the, it, kind of between, is the way it feels like, from what I read. Somewhere between Space Engineers and No Man's Sky. Like, it's less um, less constrained on vehicles. Like, you can... What, what I would look forward to... What, one thing I hate about Space Engineers is the amount of space it requires to do something basic. Right? Like, your oxygen container is huge. It's like the size of a person. Right? Like... Um, each thruster is like the size of a person. So like, even on a small ship, it ends up being huge. And you're like, all right, anyway. So yeah, this is the, the game. I don't know what to do. <laughs> I just, I don't know how to, what antibiotic, I don't know what I'm doing with this stuff. Can I sell market price? I don't know what that is either. PDA, oh, sh here we go. I did that. Why is it not? Press F to enter escape. Oh, I just did that. Look at all that stuff. The Santa hat. What? There's a Santa hat. Oh, in the. In the bar, yeah. Where? Let's use the armor locker. Okay, is there an armor locker back there? Is there a highlight attempt? Hit W to wear it. I can wear it in an armor locker. Oh. I don't have it though. Oh, there's a tent. I need that tent. For survival reasons. Nice. How do I get in? Oh, I can't sleep during the day. All right. That's a nice tub. What else is this at? Purified water. Nice. <laughs> Perfect. Alright, anyway, so that's the game. Yeah. That sounds like a fun one to explore. Alright, do you want to play a little Phasma? Sure. I played for 
single mission in the same farmhouse that we had played in before and went into the first room and within 30 seconds there was a ghost slamming the door shut and saying hi to me oh, okay. and I hadn't done a thing and I was like all right <laughs> so one thing so I, I did I don't know if you read that whole I did yeah so there's a whole bunch of stuff these guys 